expression and hex long so i'll be using um color purple i'll be using dark purple and i'll be using color two air and this is expression premium and it is in um th this is dark color purple and i'll be using the african collection expression and this is in um just purple the light purple and this is color two and this is x long air yeah so I'll be using um four packs of hair for this and I'm um spraying my hair here just to make it wet and very easy to work with and now I'll be section I'll be sectioning my hair in um in um different s section and I'll be using the purple first to make this hair so um I'm just making the edges of my hair and I'm making it big I don't want to take the edges of my hair small and I'm doing a big box braid so I'm just like trying to um do it and make my hair and my edges are really thin so like i'm really careful with making the edges of my hair so yeah so i'm just making it and at the tip of my hair most times i twist the tip of my hair i don't braid it all through and that's what i'm doing here and yeah i'll be using the color two now for the second section of the hair so i just used like different colors of air like for each air like i do whatever um i want to use like i don't um i'm not i don't um subject myself to like going in a pattern i just take whatever i want to take i take the black the dark purple or like the light purple i just do different things i want to do so yeah So now, because I've gotten um, to the part where I have a lot of hair on my head and my hair is pretty short, I'm going to use my comb to part um, my hair, like to show the difference between where I want to make and where I don't want to make. So like this is a kind of like a very easy way to make short hair. So I just am parting with a small comb and then like I, tr I um started making my hair so like it was very easy for me to make my hair there because that part of the head is really full so it was very easy for me to make my hair after parting it with the comb and this is how it looks like after i'm done making the hair it looks really neat so i'm just going to be doing this side of the hair like there are lots of hair on this side of the hair too so i did the same like technique i parted it with the comb and like it was really easy for me to do yeah So this is how the tip of the hair looks like so yeah so like that was just of um the smoothing and stuff that i did with the hair and now i'll be doing the back of the hair so i wet the back of the hair with water to, again m2 so that's why it looks wet in case you're wondering <laughs> so uh, that's it doing i'm um, the back of the hair like no order to just different colors this is the dark purple yeah, and just I'll just like start box braiding or braiding the hair. So 
so this is how the back of the hair looks like and i'm almost done with the hair yeah i have like just very few left there and i think i'm done with the hair yeah yes so yeah i'm just i'm smoothing the hair like i'm trying to cut out um air that's like fly away hair and this is how the back look like and like yeah I'm done making this hair. I'm trying to like section my hair to put another down. This is the water. Like you have to be really careful when you are doing this part. So yeah, like after I was done with this thing and I, I wasn't even on camera, I burnt my scalp. Then it's okay. Like, so to get a very smooth um tip, just put the hot water on your hair, then wipe it with your towel. Then after you are done wiping it with the towel, can you see the hair the tip? It's like not very smooth. Then you put it in the water again. Then this time don't wipe it with the towel. Just use your hand to like um to like sh shake it a little bit. It looks smoother because you can't put um hot water on like the upper part of your hair. You just dip the towel in hot water and use it to massage the upper part of your hair so it's effective. So yeah, I'm done with the hair now and I'll be putting cream and this is pretty much how it looks like after I'm done putting the hot water. I'm just arranging it and now like to get a shiny look, like just use um the um blow dry use it like apart from using it to dry um the water from your hair use it like put it very close to to your hair when you put it very close to your hair it helps smoothen the flyaways on the hair because you can't use scissors to like solve everything it's like using candle to um burn it. it's really effective like it makes it look really really smooth yeah that's all about this hair thanks so much for watching guys see you guys in my next video bye guys